Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the channel where we talk about stuff. So, over the course of the last five years or so, we've had um, rumors of a lot of banks, companies, and institutions getting into the cryptocurrency space. The really interesting part is that as I go over daily news on this channel and my other channel, The Modern Investor, um, daily... These banks and institutions are becoming really, I was, gonna, I was gonna say far too comfortable, but becoming really comfortable uh, with things within the cryptocurrency space. There's one company in particular that has an enormous slew of partnerships under their belt. I'm pretty sure you can guess exactly who they are. Very recently, we had news from one of the largest banks on the planet, they're called HSBC. They recently announced that they are actively going to be getting into the cryptocurrency digitized world of assets. And can you guess who they announced that they're going to be working with? Yep, once again, it's Ripple. Um, I make sure, as always, all I am is, 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 is the news guy to bring you the news of what's going on in the news about the cryptocurrency news. HSBC has announced that they want to launch a digital asset custody service for their institutional clients. The way that this works is that as every bank that we've been hearing about over the course of the last four to five years is getting into the cryptocurrency space, they tend to offer these services to institutional clients, the richy riches first, because rich people always look after other rich people. The other idea is that as we get further into the future, they expect or it is expected that at some point nearly everything will have value plus will be digitized and put onto a blockchain. Little difficult. It's kind of the idea of everything basically being an NFT. People believe or still think of the idea of an NFT as being a, a digital cat or a digital the camera's weird, it keeps blinking out, or a digital animal of some sort. The idea of an NFT is simply being able to tell this from that. Bitcoin is not an NFT because all the Satoshis relatively look the same. However, you can tell that this digital diamond is not the same as, what? why did I put my hand in front of my face? As that, as that digital piece of art. So, HSBC has announced that they are going to be partnering with a company called Medaco, M-E-T-A-C-O, which is owned by, you guessed it, owned by Ripple. And they will be using Medaco for this new service in 2024 to begin to digitize physical gold and digitize other things that they also are storing for institutional clients on Medaco's platform. If you look around a lot of times, when I was looking for information about Medico, uh, the word Ripple was closely associated with it. Uh, they were originally a company that was in Switzerland. For those of you who don't know one of the basics of acquisitions, the way that it actually works is if you as a company are trying to work in, let's say, Switzerland, but you do not have the paperwork to be able to custody and or issue new assets, you acquire a company that can custody and issue new assets within Switzerland who already has the paperwork. So that way when you acquire them, you are then able to, as a company, also work in Switzerland, custody and also issue assets as well. It says, with this move, Ripple will be able to expand their offerings to be able to custody, issue, and settle any type of tokenized asset onto a blockchain as well. Yes, not the, uh, this doesn't have to be the craziest or the longest video. It's more of a, another thing has happened within the world of Ripple that continues to make the news all the time. I will not ever understand, as far as I am concerned, why people continue to um, ignore this or pretend like it's not happening when this company is clearly doing everything that they said years ago, plus also at this point taking over a large portion of the cryptocurrency space. But in a similar manner to 2017, those who pay attention usually end up benefiting the most. 
Yes, yeah, so the news is HSBC is going to be working with Medico and Ripple to begin to digitize assets. Uh, if you want to look more into that, as always, you know, um, it is something to keep in mind as we get into the future. It is expected that basically everything of value will have an NFT attached to it as a form of like an ID to be able to say that you actually own this. And now HSBC has joined the crypto space. And they partnered with Ripple. As always, the um, articles will be available in the description below. For those of you who want to look and read and see more about it, um, I do hope that you have all enjoyed. I do hope you all are having a great day, morning, afternoon, evening, wherever you are, wherever you might be. I do hope it is absolutely fantastic. Thank you all once again for watching, listening, liking, commenting, and or supporting. And I will most certainly be talking to you all soon. See you.